And this is what you play snooker for, or make a career in snooker for. If I was in Ronnie's shoes, that would really annoy me and make me determined coming at tonight's session. So this red, this is a good early opening chance. Five. Thirteen. Ronnie supporting a different hairstyle from this afternoon, isn't he? Got it. Uh, Imagine he'd try and get it for blue or colour. Man, he's gone through the lot. Needs something to happen with the black pots. It's exactly. I said today, Willie. 29. The first sort of half dozen eight shots in every frame is so important for Ronnie. You see, he's in first and looks now odds on to win the first frame. Pink available in the middle, slightly overrun for his desired position. Forty four. All of this championship run, he's, he's never really had one whole session where he's played unbelievable. Fifty two. I mean, you consider. The easy pinky missed in the last frame of the session. This is a very poor cup of tea at the hour or so break he had. So two. 59. 66. Just over five and a half straight on him making another century. Fifty four. Eighty two. Fifty-six centuries at the Crucible this year. I thought there'd be a lot more the way that people have been playing. Ninety. Played for both reds rather than just one. <coughs> Immaculate start though. Ninety-five. There's a century. O'Sullivan's thirteenth in the tournament. And if it's ever a right time to make. Well, no clearance, but a great start from shot in that frame. Most of the levels of the match. We're all square. 12 all. 12 all. So Ronnie breaks off. First. Foul. No miss. Mark Selby, six. Foul. Not the way I wanted to play it. <clears throat> In between and behind the yellow and brown. Head on, so he's rolling in, but needs to get this exactly right. The red's there, how's the key ball? Needs to bounce. Хорошо, 
Doutor. The obvious Six. he'd love to play on is a one to the left of the black. So right cool. If he has, he'll certainly be playing. Yes, he has got the angle. <coughs> Always come too low. Need to bounce off the cushion. That's a good shot. Was not the room. Decided not to play it. As you can see, he's in part in bottom on the cue ball, so he must have found a red that pots. I well, played for the one on the right hand side. Looks like he's trying to screw it, screw this in. It could stick in the pack this one. Done well though, hasn't he? <coughs> yes, if the twelve frames he's won, Stephen, as you rightly say, his highest break is still at a seventy four, which means that <coughs> Three reds here as well. He can get on the one in the middle that's near the, nearest the cushion. This might be a fraction too hard. Twenty-nine. I don't think I'll play it here. It is the shot. Let's play a more exact position. That time the kiss was helpful. Wow. And that is fine. Yeah, if it's not the best shot, it certainly hasn't been shot better. Nine. <coughs> yeah, well, if they so can the corner that is. Obviously it doesn't. So playing for a gap here. That's perfect. Seventeen. Purposely finishes low on the block again here to play this with a cut on the next red, but well, you know, he played to flick them. And you know, I'd have play thought he'd ball. But he'll be disappointed. Ronnie O'Sullivan, twenty-four. Pocket, the only problem. Wow, I didn't see that coming. Oh, this is not good, is it? Going to win the frame without worrying about the two reds. Won't be playing to if he needed to. 50. He's loved it. He doesn't look like he's a snooker, is incredible. Just has never put that extra ball, and now he's done it again. Uh, but no end of times is Miss Frame Ball. And he used to do that. He used to be very, very good in clinching frames. was always causing a problem for that positional shot. <coughs> the one on the side cushion. Seems a little dangerous this, but obviously it was he felt on this. <coughs> Make sure it doesn't go anywhere near the yellow pocket. That's why he just played a, just to push the red on the side cushion. Didn't want to risk going off this back cushion back into Bork.
Decided to go all out for the pot there. <coughs> Nico McBrain, that is the drummer from Iron Maiden. So a lot of dignity in this evening. Hopefully, waiting. No attempt to the pots, just a case of whether Ronnie feels oh, like... But he'd be very, very pleased to take the lead again at 13-12. But that kind of shot would have been tough. And that's the beauty of Ronnie gets... Delayed reaction. Here comes from Cupar. Nice. 